Welcome to Camelot Hills again. Uh, we recently had a video about a month or so ago that we showed you how we went it through and uh, we pulled some solid wire that was coated with plastic and we pulled it between all our 2 by 4 What's happened is the goats like to stand in the feed buckets and when they do they were pulling on the wire and eventually it just wore through and broke. So what we're going to do today is we're going to replace it with a different solution and we hope this works. Here we are. What we're going to do to replace the bad stuff that we had to take out uh, is we're going to take this threaded rod that I purchased from a local hardware store. Uh, basically it's a three foot long uh, quarter inch rod and we're just going to stick it through here as I've done with these other two but I want to show you how and put it up so hopefully this will hold the buckets with the weight of the goats when they put their hooves in the buckets and try to stand on things. So uh, watch and see how it goes and I'll kind of talk you through it as we go. First thing you've got to do is drill your holes. Just figure out where you want to put them and then kind of go from there. But we're just going to kind of start about an inch off the back of the wall. So we're going to take a rod and we're going to stick it through the holes that we just made. Once it gets into the second one you might want your hammer just to kind of tap it through. Now the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, this part of it. We're only going to have about two inches of it showing over here. And we're just going to whack it back and bend it about 45 degrees. Now, we're going to stick it a little further through. About another inch or two. That's a little too much. Let's go back a little bit. Alright. Now, this rod breaks pretty easily. So if you just grab it right here and you just pull it and you bend it straight out. When you bend it back, it's going to break right off. So, now you take it and you push it back through, and you come over here and you bend this side. Without hitting the other rod. And what that does is it keeps the rod, when the goats start pushing on it right there, it keeps the rod from coming out, because if you didn't do that, what would happen is they would eventually put their weight on it and it would just pull it right on out. So we bend it. And there now we have our bucket hook. So that's it for this little project. Now it's time for us to move on out to the next one and see what else we can get done around the farm. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and come back and see us for more interesting little projects like this one. If this one happens to fail, we'll make sure that we come and we tell you our solution to fixing it if it does. You can find us at CamelotHills.net and on Facebook at Facebook.com slash CamelotHills. We hope you have a nice day and come back and see us again.